My name is Ashton Hutchinson. I'm the current head coach for the Overwatch team here at Ottawa. I'm currently pursuing sports psychology as my major to later on take that down the field for esports. I play Overwatch the majority of the time while I'm here. Long time ago, back in Halo 2, I would just hop online and just kind of, you know, grind it out and like kind of being good and making people that are like 10 years older than me extremely mad was something that was like really funny. But my dad ended up bringing me down to Comic-Con in Chicago, down around Halo Reach and was pushing me to go into uh, this double Elam tournament. He was like, just try it, just try it. If you, if you like it, you like it and you can keep doing it. But if not, you know, you can at least say you did it. I did it, I had loads of fun and just kind of like went from there. Overwatch came out and like I touched it and I saw OD come out and I was like, wow, this is really cool. And I like just hunkered all my time into that, uh, like crazy amounts. As much as uh, I dislike the game for wearing on my mental, it's, uh, it's still something I can't give up. It's definitely for sure a, uh, a piece of me that is not letting go. Ash, 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 Ash. Ash. Ready? Oh, watch out with a left. Watch out with a left still. Yeah. We know 12. Let's go! No! Holy no! We won with a coach. We literally won a contenders match with a coach. Dude. Uh, coaching for the Overwatch team here in Ottawa is stressful in certain ways. It's definitely different having uh, spent my time in contenders for the last year. There's a lot of more uh, personal, like physical to physical connection of like trying to like really build relationships. Uh, especially to like you mess up or have you know some sort of disagreement that spikes your attitude for the whole day you're next to that person that's a it's a really big change if anything i would say it's definitely a, a challenge for sure past this year for the plans for the future um definitely a strive for top 10. it's going to be hard it's going to be difficult um but i think it's something that's 100 percent doable a lot of really, really strong teams have moved from contenders and the majors to collegiate now, and I think it's going to be really interesting to see uh, the competitive side once we get there next year.